Seriously Ditto. Uh, we are standing here with Amy and John from Clutch Play Games. Hi everybody. Uh, they have created a game called Little Chomp, and Little Chomp is what a caterpillar that eats stuff, which is close and dear to Ditto's heart, because you know Ditto loves to eat stuff. So, um, I guess first off, have you ever been interviewed by a fabricated American before? I have not. Uh, no, not to my knowledge. Okay. All right, excellent. So, another first. Yay! Very happy. Um, so, uh, can you tell my fans a little bit what your game, uh, Little Chomp, is about? John, you want to take this one? Sure, why not? Um, little Chomp, uh, you play a little caterpillar. Uh, your goal in life is to collect fruit and to distribute that fruit to your friends so that they become beautiful butterflies. Oh, okay. That sounds nice. And it is about sharing, too. And about not dying, which is an important part of life. Oh, yes, that is an important part of life. It is indeed. Um, so, do you feel that this game is fun for kids and families? Absolutely. It is totally fun. Good. In fact, yesterday, my favorite moment of the day was a little six-year-old kid walks up to the table and he picks one of the hardest levels to play. And next to him was an adult who could not keep up with him. And it was, it was so cute. Everybody was cheering him on. And it was, it was a great moment. Oh, yeah, that's great. Really Super up. happy. Awesome. Um, so, this is available on uh, mobile platform? It is. It's on uh, iOS and Android, so it's available on the Google Store, uh, Google Play, the Android App Store, and uh, the uh, Apple App Store. Okay. And why did you choose to develop on uh, mobile versus like a console or PC? Uh, we spent years actually as a mobile developer. Uh, for, uh, we made games, uh, the Touch Pets, Dogs, and Cats series, so it was just our background and our experience. Um, uh, those are also family friendly games, although they are not available anymore. But you are, um, that is our background and it's what we live in it. So okay. we kept that uh, And do you think that uh, family friendly games are uh, more popular on the iOS or the mobile platforms? Do you think there are more of them out for mobile than uh, some of these big console or PC games we see? I would say that that's, that's definitely possible. There's yeah. certainly a glut of, of games on the store, um, and it's definitely a, a great platform for kids just because you can, you can hand them your iPhone, you can hand them their iPad, and they just love to they'll just pick it right up. Okay. Yeah, it is definitely easy to pick up, too. Um, and finally, what do you feel are some ways that um, parents can help their kids with games and make sure their ki kids are safe playing games, especially like some of the online and social games out there? Uh, probably just going into the, the parental guidance areas on the iPad and the iPhone. They both have lots of ways of restricting the appropriate content, um, uh, guided access, and uh, you know, monitoring. Just making sure that they only play the kinds of games that you want to make sure that they play. And also turn off IAP if you don't want your children oh, accidentally yeah. in -app charging right. five hundred dollars. Yeah. Yes, indeed. Yeah, that is in-app purchase. Yes. Yeah, that's yes. important too. Yes, you would not. You would not probably spend $500 a little chomp. That would not be right. possible. We didn't design it that way. But, okay. Uh, yeah, to All right, great. Um, so, little chompy available now for iOS and Android? It is. Yes. Awesome. Uh, anything else you'd like to say about your game or company? Nothing springs to mind. <laughs> okay. 